guys, this is a random video. <laughs> I am sitting here at work waiting for a lady in administration to sign some papers for me. Sorry about that. There we go. Something popped up on my screen, but anyway, I'm um, waiting for a lady from the administration to sign some papers for me. Um, good morning. Anyways, sure's a lot of activity down this this hallway. But anyway. Yeah. <clears throat> I said it was random. I don't normally do random videos. Um but um I'm probably getting a little delirious. Delirious. Cause I just completed twelve hour shift. And anyway, this lady, she said she'd be here between 7.15 and 7.30. So by 7.29, I hadn't heard from her because she said if she was going to be running late, she'd let me know. Anyway, by 7.29, I hadn't heard from her, so I decided to text her. And then she texts back and she said that, um, oh, I apologize. I'm running late. I'll be about 20 minutes late. Well, anyway, that means she probably won't get here to about 8 o'clock. I'm ready to go home. I just completed a 12-hour shift. We were busy. My eyes are starting to hurt because I'm sleepy. And I'm just like... I mean, I get people, you know, run late and stuff. I'm like, really? I mean, just really? <laughs> and I guess the thing is that if I hadn't had, if I hadn't have texted her, was she gonna, like, tell me she was gonna be running late? Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I'm try to be positive about it. Anyway, on a brighter note, the verse of the day is coming from Luke chapter 9, verse 24, and it's talking about whomever wants to save their life will lose it, and whoever wants to um, lose their life for Jesus' sake, you know, will have life. Um, I think that's what it says. Um, I'm sure you're familiar with that scripture too. But anyway, it's coming from Luke 9, chapter 9, verse 24. But basically, you know, if you're holding on to this life, you know, what this life, what your life offers and you're so engrossed <clears throat> in your life that you don't want to give it up and stuff. And you're eventually going to lose it. <clears throat> so basically, you just want to be able to just walk away from this life. There should be nothing just holding, pulling you so much that you just like, oh no, I can't let go. I got to stay, you know. If Jesus was to show up and say, you're ready to come back with me, would you be like, um, can you give me a year or two? I want to wait to my grandchildren well, not my, me personally, grandchildren graduate because I got longer than a year or two. But, you know, it's basically like, you know, you just want to be able to be able to walk away from this life because, you know, what's more important is having eternal life for Jesus Christ. But anyway, I... <laughs> 
I'm never on this side of the hospital <clears throat> administration side, you know, because I don't work in administration or human resources, but this certainly is busy over here. I mean, it's just like constantly people walking by and if you see me looking around and stuff, <clears throat> I'm just looking around, just, you know, watching the people go by. But anyway, we are coming up on, let me see if there's a clock. <sighs> I don't see a clock, but I'm pretty sure I'm getting close to 8, 8 o'clock. Y'all ever, <laughs> ever notice when I do videos sometimes? Y'all see my double, my, um, double chin? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's kind of funny. I'm, I know, I'm delirious. I'm tired. I'm ready to go home and get some sleep because I got to be back tonight. And not only do I have to be back tonight, I'm also back tomorrow night. Yep, three nights in a row three 12 hour nights and we're busy and we're gonna be busy tonight so I'm like ready for my head to hit the pillow and my eyes to go to sleep anyway <laughs> if you guys like turned off this video I don't blame you Basically, I'm just trying to keep myself entertained, pass the time away while I wait. Sad thing about it is, I already clocked out because initially she told me she'd be here between 7.15 and 7.30, so I went ahead and clocked out. Um, because I'm like thinking, okay, well... I didn't hear from her. I kept I kept looking at my phone to see if she had texted. So I said, oh, well, she must be down there in the administration office. Well, she wasn't. So I'm going to be here like an hour over. And, yeah, I'm going to have to get paid for this hour because, you know, my time is precious. My time is valuable. You know, I just, well, I won't say I just figured out why it's so busy on this trip. But the cafeteria is down this way. So everybody keeps walking past here to the cafeteria. So. That's why it's so busy over here. Play. Yeah, anyway, I'm gonna end this video because I'm not really saying anything. And if you guys are still watching, I'm like thinking, y'all must be bored too. So I will see you all in my next video. Thanks for watching. Peace.